my YouTube is your subscribers and everybody's in the remaining social networks. This is Dark King, and today, well, we're going to do a let's react to the Sonic Mania Adventure Part 2. That just came out. I wasn't expecting it, I n wasn't following it, like, at all. So, yeah, let's just do it. I love the first one, it was so funny. It kind of reminded me of Tom and Jerry. Anyway, with a type of humor. So, the second one has tails on the cover. Well, thumbnail, so, let's see. And, but. So, Sega probably presents. Oh, I'm dying to get my hands on the boss. I did a last play of this a while ago. Well, first things first. Half tails working on tornado, and it should be. <laughs> and Sonic being smug, as usual. Oh, so A, it's a uh, ammo detector, and B, let me guess. <laughs> okay, that's totally an Eggman boss. It fits so well. <laughs> he got rigs! <laughs> okay, that's funny. <laughs> yep, pull Tom and Jerry. Ah. <laughs> they're even <laughs> Wow, they're even adding the damage uh sound effects. This is perfect. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this reminds me so much of Tom and Jerry. It's so funny. Oh! And this is straight out of uh, Sonic X. The way they found the emeralds. Okay, that was awesome. You know, I grew up watching uh, Tom and Jerry and the Looney Tunes, so this is right up my alley. And also, this is so well done. Honestly, I wouldn't mind a, a new series with... Oh, that's new. Anyway. Where the series actually had a plot, but this is a good... Oh? Oh! <laughs> really, Tails? You let the keys in. Well, not necessarily. He's the Eggman, so... He could easily have, uh, you know, Jerry Rick the thing. Anyway, that was funny. Though, I assume the Kutchev's gun will apply next... Uh, uh, in the next part. If you're not familiar with this, uh, what the Chekhov's gun is, the idea that if you show a gun in the first act of a movie, you have to use it in the second one. In this case, I'm talking about Metal Sonic. You know, we saw him last part, but not in this one. So I'm assuming it's for the final one. <sighs> but, like I said, this is so much fun. The references. The honestly, this miniseries is perfect. Like I said, I wouldn't mind one in the one with the plot in the Bill of Sonic X. Only you know, oh, just don't throw Chris in. Even though I didn't mind him when I was a kid, you know, it was from my era, so it made sense. Anyway, that aside, hope you enjoyed this, my reaction, and the part two of Sonic Many Adventures. So, until next time, forget to like, subscribe, and you ring the bell. Well, you know the deal.
Till then, I'll see you around. Ta-ta!